lots of people wanted to see me do a game review, so, hi everyone, Human and Kai Rider Nathan here, and today I will be doing a game review on Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Now, the story for the Jedi Fallen Order is that in the game, you play as a Padawan named Cal Kestis, a survivor of the Great Jedi Purge following, which is in the game is set five years after the events of Star Wars Revenge of the Sith. Cal has, has hidden out on the planet Bracca as a scrapper, and when he has to use the Force to save his only friend on Bracca, Prof, from falling to his death, Cal ends up getting exposed as a surviving Jedi. Now, Cal has to, like, had to escape Bracca with another surviving Jedi, Seer Junda, and the you know, Latero pilot, Grease Dritus. And they travel to different planets in search of, a, of an object called an, at, called an Astrium, which ha holds the location of several Force-sensitive children. In the game, you even... In the, in, in the planet Borgano, you meet in each level of the game you learn you relearn help Cal relearn some old abilities like a force push, a force pull, that kind of stuff. Some of the two of the bosses of the game are basically Imperial Inquisitors. Which are Jedi who have been corrupted into joining the dark side. Two of which I know are known as Trilla Suduri, who is the former Padawan of Seer Junda, and the ninth, who became the second sister, and the ninth sister's real name is Masana Tide, and she's a Daoutin. I have some Star Wars OCs myself, such as the Nautilus Zaiwan Kamrazi, Zaiwan's master, Darman Krenzar, who is a Dathomirian Grey Jedi, Zarek Kamrazi, who is Zaiwan's elder brother, Shane Vansel, my own good natured Mandalorian OC, Jarek Fest, who is a cyborg Mandalorian working for the Empire, and some and several Imperial Inquisitors. In the game, we even see some flashbacks of Cal's past, especially to the day, the, up to the day he lost his master, a last sat Jedi by the name of Jaro Tapal, during the events of Order, when Palpatine had the had executed Order sixty six. And, and well, you want to know who the real victims are in orders in the Jedi Purge? the clone troopers because they are being brainwashed into turning against their Jedi generals. My favorite part in the game is when, when you head to planet Ilum, you get to upgrade Jaro's lightsaber with parts from Seer's lightsaber into making Cal's new lightsaber, a split saber. And on the final level, and for those on the final level against Darth Vader, if you try, the only option you have is run. Run like literal fucking hell. Because D Vader is new, is all but impossible to defeat. And escapes your only option. They're making a sequel called Jedi Survivor. And Cal's got some face fuzz. Or as I think Siri might have developed alopecia. I kind of wish that Jedi Survivor would be on the PS4, to be honest. Next time, I will be doing a review on Monster Hunter World Iceborne. This is Keyblade Makai writer Nathan signing off. See you later, and have a good one.